It's a booming health craze. Standing in a chamber as liquid nitrogen reduces the temperature to minus 220 degrees. But now cryotherapy is in the spotlight for all the wrong reasons after this young woman was mysteriously found dead at a cryotherapy center. She was frozen, frozen solid. Help! 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 We work at cryotherapy. Okay, stay on she the line. She put herself in the table by herself. Basketball superstar LeBron James uses cryotherapy to treat injuries. Lindsay Lohan has also tried it out to keep her skin young. Actress Mandy Moore has tried it too. Here you go. Inside Edition producer Brianna Deutsch went for a sub-zero session at a cryotherapy center in Los Angeles earlier this year. My hands feel like they're going to come off. But for the young woman who was found dead, the chamber became an icy tomb. 24-year-old Chelsea Ake Salvacion was a manager at the Rejuvenize Spa in Las Vegas. These promotional photos show Chelsea at the cryotherapy spa. Her body was found inside a cryotherapy chamber by a co-worker opening for business. Chelsea had been frozen solid an estimated 10 hours. Oh my God! I just got to work. She must have put herself in a chamber by herself. Okay, honey, honey. It's nitrogen. Is she breathing? Is she breathing? No, oh, but she's dead. Her uncle, Albert Ake, says Chelsea was very experienced at administering cryotherapy. She's done this several times to herself, and she's done it to clients. So she knew what she was doing. Ake says authorities told him his niece died moments after stepping into the chamber. She was dead in seconds. So the question we need to ask is, what could have caused that? The cryo treatment center told us they are incredibly saddened by Chelsea's death. They also say their employees undergo strict and rigorous training, adding their cryo chambers are never locked while in use.